Where you live could determine how long you live. In fact, did you know there are places in the world called blue zones where people live longer and some say better? Nutritionist Deborah Enos has been looking into this for us. Thank you for being Absolutely. here as always. So first of all, where are these blue zones? Yes, so there's actually one in the U.S., Loma Linda, California, Southern California. Um, there's one in Co Costa Rica, um, Sardinia, which is off the coast of Italy. Mm -hmm. Um, one in Okinawa and one in Greece. Wow. So five different places. I gotta go. Right? I know. We, need, oh, we need to move to Greece. We need I more think. of those in the Pacific <laughs> Northwest, right. I think. So there's a book all about this. They really hit nine points as to why a blue zone people right. live longer. But we picked out four today. So let's walk through each of these. Yes. The first is move naturally. Yes. So according to Dan Butner from the book, The Blue Zones, people who live to 100, they don't join gyms, they don't go to spin class. Oof. So they move move naturally and so they garden a lot and then of course they end up eating what they what they grow but they also have a lot of chores around their house and in their yard that they don't use mechanical devices they they push their own lawn mower they sweep mm -hmm. they rake they you know so they're very physically active so it's whatever it takes to get through your day to make sure you have enough food that's what they're doing i love that do you i do too exactly good, good, right good for a long life all right the second thing that they do in blue zones is purpose having yes a purpose it's so interesting too um according to again this book blue zones if you wake up every day with a purpose you can add eight years to your life what isn't that amazing? Eight years. So Eight what's years. Per, what kind so of purpose? I know. And so I brought some pictures because my family is my biggest purpose. And so they're very family oriented um, in all of these blue zones. And so when you think about what your purpose is, my other purpose is, you know, I want to teach the world how to be healthy. And so that gets me excited when I wake up in the morning. I wonder about what's going to happen when I retire. And I, I'm, I'll have to find something well, to do. Well, you often hear people yes, start to really slow down. Exactly when they right. So waking up with a purpose and having a real really strong um, need uh, to help really seems to make a big difference. Eight years, I'd Eight say years. so. All right, absolutely. 80% rule, what does that mean? Okay, so in Okinawa, they actually have a saying that at the beginning of every meal, eat to 80%, and they keep saying it, eat to 80%. Okay. So what happens is, it takes a little while for your for your stomach to catch up with your brain and to say, look, stop eating, Marnie, I'm full. Okay. And so that's why it's really important to take at least 20 minutes when you're eating. Well, I was mentioning earlier that I eat most of my meals with my husband, and he is a big eater, and he's a fast eater. So what happens is that can be contagious, mm -hmm. and you just end up matching what they're doing. I'm married to one too. Exactly. Okay. So what I've what I've started doing now is use a smaller plate. These are ex this is exactly the same amount of food on okay. each plate, but this one is significantly smaller. Before we let you go, talk about this because sleep is something that you added as important right. to living longer. Right. And not that they didn't mention it in blue zones because they talked a lot about taking naps, but this is a new device and it's a red light therapy and it's a company called Juve. And this is new to me, and I'm, I'm about to start practicing with this. Um, practicing with this, but what they're saying with this machine is it can help to reset your circadian rhythm. We are very. Um, we are uh, obsessed with light. I mean, we, light really makes us work better. It helps us to sleep, it helps us to function, it helps to give us energy. 93% of our day is spent inside for most Americans. So what their, their research is saying is that this red light helps to mimic being outside and just being um, out in nature. And so this is gonna end up resetting your circadian rhythms, help creating more melatonin so that you end up sleeping better. Oh, that's great. Well, Blue Zones, as yes. I said, we need more of them in <clears throat> the United right. States so that we can benefit from long, healthy lives. Deborah, exactly. always good to see you. <laughs> and if you would like to read more about the Blue Zones or see more of our Healthy Living segments, go to q13fox.com slash healthy living.